Grand Rising, welcome or welcome back. It is day two now of vlogging. I'll show you guys what I'm doing because I have a fun day. I'll be looking for jobs pretty much like the first half of the day. And then I'm getting ready to go to an art walk tonight with a friend, a new friend. So I'm a little nervous about that, but it's my favorite place to go. So it should be fun. I so far, you know, um, did my opening of my blind, turned on my heater, did some stretches, and now I think I'm going to journal and then make breakfast and coffee. And I'll see you guys then. That's stuff all over you from rubbing all over the floor. Mr. Sneaksy Man. Say hi to the camera. Mm -hmm. Hi, you are you. I've only been smoking like once a day at the end of the night, but today I thought I'd try waking and baking for the first time in like four or five weeks now. So I'm excited because I usually get like, and with my tolerance lowering, I've been getting like that just with one hit. So let's see how this goes. This is a before because you guys know I can't show you. How this is me after one day. I think I may be good, huh? What do you think? I feel good. So I have my laptop charging now because I'm gonna start looking for jobs already. And then I wrote my to-do list down and I'll just go over it with you guys really quick so we know what's in store for today. Make a grocery list to last me for a long time. I have to get like dishwashing pods and laundry pods. I'll at least apply for three more jobs, but I'm hoping it's more. I don't want to be in healthcare anymore because I actually got fired from breaking three codes of conduct by accident. So if I tell you the story, like you're probably gonna be like, okay, yeah, I can see that. I already know, okay? Making TikToks while working is very risky. But I've made a lot and I got away with them because they weren't showing anything. Well, I was in office five months ago and somebody called named Michael Meyer. I show that the name is Michael Meyer and I cover up like all the other information that's personal health information so nobody could see that. Well, the front half of the URL was showing and I don't even mean half, like a third of it was showing. It said http colon slash slash one okay they said that that showed the patient id and it didn't show the patient id and if you look up that url you can't find a single thing but what they told me is it showing life was enough for them to terminate me basically because I was exposing an internet source or internal source. But that's written on all of everything we do. Like, like the company's not called that, but like when you apply for different things, it'll say like, oh, you work for that. So in my head, it's not a secret. And it wasn't showing literally anything. Like even if I were to post that video again, I wouldn't think it was breaking three codes of conduct. So to me, it feels a little targeted, but I also feel like it was the universe telling me like that job ran its course because I was starting to get bored. So I know that the universe does things to push us in the right direction. It just sucks that it was my fault. I messed up. Universe, chill out. Yesterday's vlog was called Rock Bottom. Now we're gonna be moving up. I did a reading last night, actually. The very first card I got, it said something, rock bottom, something. And I was like, what are the 
what are the odds that I just posted a rock bottom video and the first tarot card I pull says rock bottom. I don't even feel like it uses phrases like that. Okay? So that was weird. But that was past. And then I got a present in the future. Shower and get ready because tonight I'm going to First Friday. And First Friday is an art walk. So I hope to get some videos from there, but I'm hanging out with a new friend. So I don't think I'm going to vlog much. I just realized today's 12 to 2022. So in the center, it's 222. And I've been seeing 222 a lot. If you follow me on Instagram, um, right before I got fired, I kept seeing 222, like everywhere. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. I'm like, I'm aligned. Like the breakup was meant to happen. And then I got fired and I was like, I'm aligned. Okay, Jesus Christ, you had to really go there. Yeah, and now I'm seeing 222 again, so. And I'm seeing it just now with you guys, so I think that's saying I'm on the right path with you guys. Hopefully. <laughs> and then that's pretty much it. I think I'm going to go to Chiba Hut for dinner tonight by myself before I meet up. Because we're meeting up at 7, and I'm going to eat dinner by like 6, 6.30. I'll probably go at 6, because I don't think I need that much time to eat this sub. But I'm going to have to find parking, and that's going to be hard. So, it's fine. We're good. It's all good. I got my coffee here. The creamer I used is actually caramel oat milk creamer. You guys saw the brand. And it's really, really sweet, so I have to add milk, too. Okay, I get to more now. How do I look? Oh, I never give a thumbnail. <laughs> okay, good. Oh. My God. <laughs> my poor tooth. Good thing I just went to the dentist. That's the last time I tried to drink in front of you. Well, I've submitted, um, I think just one application. But I've been looking for, like, the last 40 minutes. So I'm gonna keep looking, but I thought I'd take a break just to do my Target order. Yes, I go to Target for my groceries because I wanna do it all on one trip. But I hate ordering pickup because they always use plastic bags. Like I wish you could request like, just throw it in the basket. Cause I would put a basket in my car and they could just throw it all in there. But then it would be too much work. Like they'd have to touch each item again and again and again. So I get it, but that's um that's what i'm kind of debating right now like do i place the order or just go in and get it in there so i guess i'll just place the order now and then look some more but i just thought i'd let you guys know that that's what i'm gonna be doing i forgot to hit record okay. it's harder than i thought to get three applications submitted i heard back from one of the places and they said they already picked somebody basically um and then i applied for another place and I had to do like a test in like 16 steps so that took me probably an hour to complete and now I haven't found another one that I wanted to do yet um and I've been switching between Indeed and LinkedIn and I just look up different keywords that I would want to do right now I'm looking up assistant because I would love to just gain knowledge being like an art therapist assistant or any kind of therapy assistant. I'm trying to find one that's going to be station and full time and near me and make enough. So that's been hard. Or like the education levels, like you need your bachelor's degree and I'm a semester away from it. So I don't have it. But... I did make my grocery list and I'm waiting for Target to say it's ready, but I think I need to start picking out my outfit because it's already 4 o'clock and I was going to leave at 6. So let's pick our outfit now. Okay, I don't know where I'm going to start. It's been separated. It's like the little tank tops, the little crop tops, the little no sleeve, and then t-shirts size and then long sleeves, jacket, dresses, and then coats and robes. I think I got it. It feels like I have five of those right here. 
Have you felt that before? I hate it. This is cozy. And this has not been seen on me in a while in public. You guys have seen it. I think. I don't know actually. Maybe the coziest one. I don't know if it's gonna look as good as I think it's going to. <laughs> Like self might be cute. Cute. Like this is this is cute, you know? It's been fun. No. Absolutely not. Watch a time lapse. This might take forever. I'm gonna wear these jeans for sure, most likely, because I just wanna wear something comfy that I know I won't have like problems with all night. So I think I'll wear those for sure. And then I'm struggling between um, all three tops, pretty much, but I wanna wear this belt. So if this belt to go, this, this shirt to no go. So then it would either be this or this, but if I don't wear a belt, then we can add this. So I guess we'll just take a shower and see how we feel. Okay, well I just realized that I kind of want to do my hair. And I don't want to shower and then do my hair. And I just showered yesterday, so I think I'm going to just shower tonight. And do my hair today for the first time, like, ever. So, yeah, let's get into that. Okay, so this is my hair. I don't know if you guys can see well now because of the light going down. But I haven't curled my hair in so long. I'm like, do I hate it? Okay, so. I am basically almost done with my makeup now. I have a little bit of lip tint, some highlights, some eyeshadow, which I literally never wear. Um, but since I'm going to an art walk, I tend to run into some people I know and it made me feel like maybe I should do my hair. And then my hair said maybe I should do my makeup. And now I'm here. So I'm gonna try Soph's tip where she says just put it on the edge of your eyelashes. Okay, so the white shirt's the one I think is not gonna look good, so I'm gonna try that one on first. Just scratched my lip just a little. And apparently there's a new pimple there because it hurts so bad. I'm gonna try on first. I got it from Goodwill as well because I got these pants from Goodwill, even though they're PacSun. And this is Brandy Melville. I hear people talk about it, but I've never bought anything from there, so I wouldn't know. like the white there's no white on the belt you know we're gonna try it with the orange jacket oh my god my hair please go away all right i hate it so we're gonna try on the next shirt oh wait 
never tried doing that. That actually might work. They usually just tuck it in if it's too long. So I wanted to show the felt. Now let's see if it gets ciphered up. Get some jewelry. Simple gold necklace. Cute. I have this cute little gold chain that's pretty simple. My target order is ready, but it's already 5.15 and I wanted to leave at 6 because I need, it's going to take me probably like 30 minutes to get a parking spot and get over there and then I wanted to eat and in case it takes long you know it's probably gonna be like an hour because we're meeting at 7 so I think I'm just going to smoke and then chill until I have to leave because I didn't get to smoke yet and I was like oh wait I can't forget that ah uh, love some water go drink yours also put these earrings on and I have my light on now because it's getting dark out and I was gonna shut my blinds. I already shut my blinds and everything. So that way I could leave, but now I'm not gonna leave. So I am just going to elevate. Hopefully you guys haven't been seeing that the whole time, the whole time. But I'll see you guys when I see you. There you have it, the outfit. It's with these shoes. But I just came on here to let you guys know that I was actually just doing some breathing exercises because I'm panicking. Like, just... Did some stretches. Gotta drink some water. But it's just like parking down there sucks. But I can do it. Oh, and the road is closed that I usually take. So let's go. <laughs> uh, welcome back. I am now home and it's 11 o'clock at night and I left at so you can tell that I had quite the night. I went to Chiba Hut and I got there at like 6.30 by the time I parked and then Chiba Hut took like 30 minutes to get my food out so it was already 7 but my friend was running late too so she didn't get there until um the same time basically we met like halfway because she didn't eat yet so then we got her food and she ate and then we walked around the whole place and then we found the bar, got a drink and hung out there for a while. And then we finished the art walk and then she walked me like back to my car, like almost. I didn't let her walk me all the way because it was sketch where I parked and it was far. And she took the light rail, which was, it's like um, an above ground train here. And she took that and it's all the way on the other side of the art walk and I was like you have to walk all the way back still like I feel bad but she said she was meeting up with a friend so it was cool um it was a lot of fun though like I spent a lot of hours there with her and I thought like two hours was a lot from the last person I hung out with and we hung out a lot more hours than that right we hung out from like seven to eight eight to nine nine to ten okay no just like three more hours well I guess it was a little over ten yeah, it was like 10.30 because I just got home. Um, still, that was fun. I had fun. She was just such a good person that I was like, I'm not a good person anymore, you know? I was like, oh my God. But no, that's what I love. I want people who inspire me around me. And she definitely inspired me to like want to be kinder and nicer. And like I saw this Shrek hat on this guy and I love Shrek. And I saw it in her bio that she loves Shrek. And I was like, oh my god, look at his hat. Like, we left Shrek. And she she yells at him, like, right away when she sees the guy walking by. She's like, Shrek, oh my god, Shrek, I love you, Shrek. <laughs> and the guy loved it. He had so much fun. Or they had so much fun. I'm not sure their pronouns. And they were like, um, then we saw them again later. And she still yelled out. She was like, Shrek too, Shrek too. And they loved it even more the second time. 
um, the front group was just like, <laughs> but the person wearing the hat was like, yeah. And I just thought it was the cutest thing ever that she would yell out and she was just like picking up all this stuff and she was just uh, doing a bunch of things like that, like trying to help people like everywhere we were, but like also very like focused in on what was happening with us. Adorable. That's all I should say for now. But I think I'm going to just go to sleep now. I washed my face already, put my hair up. I think I want to smoke. Tomorrow morning, I'm going with a friend to the farmer's market. And I don't even know what time we're doing that, but I should probably go to sleep for that too. And then tomorrow, I'm going to the dinner date at 6 at Culver's, which I'm so excited about. Because I freaking love Culver's. And I haven't had it in so long. I even pulled out my free scoops, like, stash for it. And then after that, we're going to go all the way to Scottsdale and walk like the waterfront there's like an art walk there too art walk round two basically this weekend's gonna be jam-packed i'm having all this fun before sunday because sunday's gonna be very hard for me again because it's the day my ex comes with the u-haul as we know and i just have to have so much done by then because her parents are coming and if her parents like see that i didn't vacuum or that i put something in a, a weird spot or that I didn't take care of something. Like, I just feel like they're going to make my life even more of a living hell than it is. I'm excited for it to all be done, though. Because, like, after Sunday, like, I think maybe she'll have to come back one more time to get the cats. But she said she was going to try to clean and everything on Sunday. So it seems like she's just trying to get out of here. Okay, good night, guys. Love you so much. Thanks for watching. Another vlogmas down.